Good morning, everybody. Clark Twitty here from Twitty & Company with a message for potentially arriving guests to the Outer Banks. We continue to see tropical conditions across this Friday morning here on the Outer Banks. The Curry Tuck Bridge, the bridge onto the Outer Banks, is just behind me on the water, and that bridge remains closed. Our offices and phones remain closed today. Our staff is continuing to function in a remote capacity we are beginning to consider assessments regarding not only route and access information to the Outer Banks, but also assessments for your home. We ask that you bear significantly delayed services in mind as you consider traveling to the Outer Banks this weekend. The good news is that while the Outer Banks was spared the hurricane force of Hurricane Florence, big chunks of southeastern North Carolina continue to bear the brunt of what's still a very dangerous storm. Our thoughts and prayers are with our friends in southeastern North Carolina. As for you, the guests, please keep in mind access regarding the Outer Banks and your home continues to be problematic right now. Remember, our maintenance and cleaning staff have to access the Outer Banks. That could prove difficult in the next several hours. We are awaiting further information from both Dare and Curry Tuck County regarding evacuation orders and accessibility. As that information becomes available, we will share it via Twitty and Company's social media and Twitty.com's weather page. We advise that you continue to monitor North Carolina's Department of Transportation website, Dare County Emergency Management pages, as well as Curry Tuck County emergency management pages for the latest information regarding access. Twitty and Company services are delayed right now. Offices closed, phones closed. When we are able to open, our staff will have significant challenges coming back onto the island and servicing your home. We will not provide on our website information regarding the condition of your individual home. Let me say that another way. No news is good news via social media and our website. If you have not heard from us regarding the condition of your home, that's a good thing. But getting there will be problematic and will still take time. Risk and uncertainty continue to be the words of the day. And when we are confronted with risk and uncertainty, as you know, we rely on safety, number one. Communication, number two. Risk, caution, prudence are all leading to continued uncertainty as we begin to figure out what we're going to do over the weekend and most importantly how that impacts you the guest. Stay tuned to Tweeting Company's website and social media pages for more. Keep in mind again transportation continues to be problematic. We are not optimistic yet today on seeing any activity that will allow guests access to the Outer Banks today in the days to come. We will know more. We look forward to welcoming you to the Outer Banks after the full departure of Hurricane Florence and all of its impacts. Thank you for staying engaged. Thank you for all the well-wishing and offers of support for our staff. That means a lot for us as a family business and a working family designed to ensure a great vacation for your home. That will continue to take time in an uncertain atmosphere. Thank you for staying in touch. More information as it becomes available on Twitty.com.